strikes again, whoa Some niggas bitter with life and they hate me They wanna put knife in my ribs, whoa Way this shit set up, I live like Ronaldo But I never been to Madrid, whoa She said that she working, I told her come over And we could get right at the crib Hey yo, what is good family? Welcome back to Astro Nori for another video. So today we're gonna be talking about week seven and they deceived us this week, bruh. Everybody pretty much had it assured that North Face was gonna be this week. Shit, me too, honestly. And this morning, bro, I'm like, what in the actual fuck? Like, what happened, bro? Like, how do you go from North Face to Vans? Like, I don't see it. I just don't see it, but I feel like, I guess this is a good choice. We're probably gonna get North Face next week because they did throw in some subtle hints of North Face being real soon. And it would technically have to be next week because there's two of them. So they would do like a week 16, week eight or week seven, week 14, something like that kind of. They technically split it up in two. But if you guys do end up enjoying this video, go ahead and leave it a like down below. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this. You already know what it is. Let me know what your favorite piece is that's dropping this week after you watch the video if you do like these type of videos go ahead and subscribe like i said before but without any further ado man let's get straight into this video so the drop list for this week is i i'm not gonna hold you there's a couple pieces that are actually super fire that are probably gonna have some resell so i'm gonna go ahead and talk about those at the end and i'm gonna talk about all the whack ass pieces at the beginning of the video you already know how we do i'm gonna let you know if any of these pieces have resell if you should go ahead and get them if you shouldn't i'm gonna just give you my take on what you should do this week but at the end of the day you do what you want you feel me this is just an opinion of somebody who's actually buying supreme or looking into supreme like this is actually what i do let's talk about these whack ass pieces we got the bill cosby knit sweater coming out this week this shit is straight banana dicks i it's, i this is one of those pieces that i don't know like i just don't know where their head was at when they made this i'm not gonna sit here in front or gas this piece up this shit is straight butt cheeks it doesn't make sense why they would even make this it is just a target shirt it's a target sweater let me put it. matter of fact target got better sweaters than this target is actually type lit when it comes to the clothes lately but we do got this plaid beanie once again like it's no no just just no we got this cat in a hat chino pants these might be i it depends where the logo is for me and it's i it has the logo visible like when you wear a shirt it's still visible so i think these pants are okay i feel like there's only a small ass branding on it but once again if you buy pants from supreme you're not really buying it for the branding you're buying it for the quality of the pants probably not that i know what that would be like because i've never actually touched a pair of supreme pants the branding is probably like the size of my pinky and i guess it's okay the burgundy or the bluish colorway probably would be the best shit is still ass don't get it twisted we got this bc six panel it basically has like a t-rex on it and it says supreme bc under it which is basically before christ when the dinosaurs were alive but yeah we do got this coming on like two denim colors then like the rest are like a canvas material what it looks like to be this shit is ass if you're going for resale just just don't don't cop anything i've mentioned so far because you're gonna lose you're gonna lose there's nothing good coming out of that. If you like it for your personal, then by all means, but for resale, just straight up, no. Next up, we got this Polar Tech zip up jacket. This is like one of those cozy ass jackets. It's like this super like cozy ass, fluffy ass material. This is the balaclava from like fall winter 17, but it's like this fluffy material. And this shit is probably super comfortable, like super cozy, not even gonna lie, but it's still a pass for me. Next up, we got this corduroy shirt. Y'all already know how I feel about shirts, bro. It's a no like it's a no-go there's probably been like one or two shirts that are actually like oh, okay like the cdg one that shit was this shit was all right there's been a couple of them that are all right but this one is not one of them it's corduroy it's just a simple ass shirt has the classic logo but if this is what you're into if you like wearing like corduroy shirts and shit by all means like it's it's yours it's literally yours you could get it as soon as it drops and nobody will take it from you just go ahead and get it and you're good like you're gonna be you're set you're all set we got this leather trucker jacket now bruh this is one of those pieces that's just like for me personally it's unnecessary i know some people are gonna like this some people are actually gonna be feeling this piece a lot but for me it's it's how do i put this no like it's this shit is probably gonna be so expensive bro you could probably pick up like five other items and be under the price of this jacket it's a leather jacket a leather supreme jacket seven hundred dollars that's all i'm gonna say but if you like it you like it you feel me we got this liquid silk camp cap this shit about silky as fuck i would not get a silk hat just miss me with that you could dead ass miss me with that i'm not getting a silk camp cap and it's liquid that shit just sounds all wrong liquid silk first of all how could liquid be silky 
think about that. But next up, we got this Cat in a Hat beanie. I guess this is a Dr. Seuss collab at this point because they're dropping a lot of shit with this logo on it. The beanie's pretty cool. Like, what can I say? The small logo that was on the pants is on the beanie. But since the beanie is so scaled down, it looks way bigger on the beanie. So I would definitely go for this before the pants. We got more S logos coming out this week. The Polar Tech ones. S logos are actually the shit. And I might, maybe just might go ahead and get an S logo this week. I'm actually missing out on the S logos. I might cop one. The colorways are actually hitting. I like that cream color. I like the teal. There's a couple other colors as well. I also feel like the cat in the hat beanie might have like $20, $25 resell depending on the color because that's usually how it goes. Probably that baby blue color is going to be the one with the best resell. That's just my opinion though. S logos, I doubt they'll have any type of resell. Now these Supreme Vans, bruh, why couldn't they just do some old schools? Like, I just don't understand why they choose the bootiest type of vans to do a collab with. Like, bruh, there's old schools. Like, just go with old schools and you will not miss. It would always be a hit. You could go with the eras, with the old schools, the skate highs, but everything other than that mainly, or slip-ons, anything other than that, bruh, it's just, it's a bin of trash. Like, just throw that shit in there and keep it smoking. You do not need no fucking Sid Pro Vans. What does that even mean? What does that mean? What does that mean? Somebody let me know in the comments. What does Sid Pro Vans? Isn't Sid the dude from Ice Age? Like, how? where's the correlation? I don't know. But we do got this embroidered pocket tee. I honestly do not know what it says, so I gotta check real quick. So it says Supreme on the pocket. Not bad. This is actually not bad, but this is cut and sewn, so it's probably gonna be overpriced and it's just not worth it in my opinion, or personally for me, it's not worth it. There's better tees that drop that aren't like $70 and there's some tees that drop at that $70 price point that are better than this like they have the supreme arc logo and shit like that i would buy one of those before this but next up we do got this warm-up hockey jersey this one might be a flop. Now, some of these colors might have some resale. I personally feel like that blue and red color might have resale or that red and yellow, but sometimes most of these jerseys just flop. So I wouldn't get this for resale because I don't want you to go ahead and follow what I say and then take a L or cop a brick. I don't want you to cop no bricks out here. You feel me? We do got this big letters sweatshirt. I don't know, but for some reason, these big ass letters with the big branding of Supreme have resale sometimes. And once again, I don't want to tell you to cop a brick, but but this colorful one might maybe just have resale on this one i would personally say follow your instinct if this is what you think is gonna be good for you then cop it but there's one piece this week that i know has to have resale like if that doesn't this week was a flop for sure but next up we got this world famous crew neck once again i don't know what it says but let me check real quick so it says supreme dead in the middle it's like pretty big then in the middle of where it says supreme it says established 1994 world famous this one is actually not bad i do like like that lilac colorway not bad that cream and red might have resell there's a cream and red colorway somewhere in there it's like the third one from the front you'll see it like right here that third one from the front might just have resell it has big supreme branding and that cream and red colorway is hitting like trust me after that we do got a piece that is probably one of the ones that i'm gonna be going for this week because i'm gonna need this pretty soon but we do got this chain license plate frame i do believe that it is a set now i don't know if you're gonna get a gold one and a silver one or like a set of silvers and a set of gold. I don't know how that's gonna work, but this piece is actually really hard. I do like it. Like it does have the Supreme branding on the actual chain link at the bottom and it has the box logo behind where your license plate would go. Personally, I would only use one of these cause I don't feel like you need both, especially if they're different colors. It depends on the type of car or color of car. You already know, you gotta make it match. Like you're not about to make it look retarded. I don't know. I feel like this is gonna have some type of resale though, for sure. This is like the only accessory that's gonna be dropping this week as well. So I feel like it will have some type of resale and it's sick i don't think they've done like a license plate frame before correct me if i'm wrong but that's just me next up we got this champion jacket y'all already know how i feel about these this is not a go that's just for me this is not a go for me like i feel like you could buy a regular champion jacket and you'll be better off like how many champion logos do you need this shit got like six logos on the sleeves one on the front and like 10 on the back how many logos do you need i think they're running out of fuel like the champion and supreme collab is 
going downhill at this point. For me, this shit is just a complete pass. I was never really a huge fan of Champion with Supreme or Champion jackets. So this is just no, it's a, it's a no, okay? It doesn't even have no Supreme branding on the front. That shit has a 94 on the side. Like now we're talking about the last piece. This last piece, bruh, is probably one of the best pieces. Like people have actually been waiting for this to drop. Me being one of them. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get it though. I'm not gonna lie. Cause I got like bigger plans. I'm trying to get these off whites tomorrow or after tomorrow. And I need these license plates. Like I actually do. So I don't know if I'm gonna actually dedicate my time to getting this cat in the hat hoodie. This shit is fuego though. Do not get it twisted. That light blue colorway, shit is hitting. That mustard colorway, shit is hitting. That forest green, hitting then after that every other color is still hitting but it's not like eh, it's going like downhill after that but this one for sure i believe will have resell just look at it bro it's a cat in a hat first of all it's dr seuss with supreme second of all the branding on it is perfect like it's not extra it actually looks like it belongs there so that one might have resell for sure i would definitely say you could actually make like a good 50 60 maybe 80 dollars. it all depends on how you make your move if you wait until the market is saturated then you already know you're fucked but if you don't then you might just be good so you just got to be on the lookout for this one that blue colorway is definitely the one that's going to have most resale in my opinion that's just the cleanest one it matches like the whole cat in the hat theme and that's just the best colorway if i were to go for it i would go for that but knowing the lag lately and the resale times i would probably take a l so license plates is coming home with papa i might just might try and get this but those license plates need to come home and i feel like that pretty much does it for this video if if you guys did end up enjoying go ahead and leave a like down below subscribe to the channel for more content like this let me know what piece you're going for this week that license plate and the cat in the hat hoodie are probably the two best pieces the cat in the hat beanie is all right the champion jacket if you're into champion then a hey, by all means but besides that there's not really some like heat like some shit that you really really need besides those three maybe four pieces i don't know just let me know down below what you're going to be trying to cook up this week hopefully i have a live cop for you guys this thursday and and I got a Supreme unboxing coming up. Stay tuned for that. Click those post notification bells as well, please. That definitely means a lot and goes a long way. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace. Stay up. And I'm out. Strikes again. Well, 